Yeah. Well, where have you put? Well, what are you looking for? Well, the Pajero for one. The Pajero? Yeah. My Pajero? No, you haven't got a Pajero. The Pajero that came at the same time as the Dutton. Yeah. And the Hartman. Yeah. That one? Yes. The green one? Yes. I, th I was going to tell you about that. I thought you dumped it out here. I did. It was in that corner. Well, all right, well, the next one. What about the Land Rover? The Land Rover's round the corner. You didn't it? No, I haven't I've just put it round the corner. Out of sight is out of mind? No. Right, okay, so what else? What else have you worked? Hey, well, where is the Pajero? Um, you know, the bloke that's got the garage round the corner. Miguel. Miguel, yeah. And he's got a big old Pajero, hasn't he? Same model. Same model, yeah. And he, he rolled it down the hillside, didn't he? I believe so. Yes. So he came and he offered me money for it, so he took it. Oh, I see. So you've sold our equipment for money and put the money in your pocket? No, I've sold our equipment and the money's going in the kitty. It's okay. in the box. Really? Really. Oh, I did tell you. We'll forget about that. I, I did just, tell you. I did tell you. I've got no interest in that old Pajero. I did. I oh know. I did tell you. Right. Or maybe but, I didn't. But, but the next thing is, my wife has yes. been saying about her little orange smart. It's red. Wasn't it? It was orange. It was red. It wasn't. Steve, that, that is red. That, it's not been that long since it was here. It was orange. It's red. It was the same colour as the Doka. No, it wasn't. It was. It wasn't. It's red. Oh, anyway. Right. The thing is, whatever, whatever colour it is, blue, yeah. pink, purple, whatever, yeah. whatever colour it is, I can't see it out of here. Well, so, you won't, will you? I don't know. That's why I'm asking you. You've been moving cars. Well, you again. said you were selling it. I was selling it. No, no. You said, you said, it's got an electrical problem I can't solve, so I'm going to sell it for parts. I said it was terminal. Yes, you said it was terminal. It's terminal. It so terminal means... Economic repair. Exactly. So I've helped you with that. <clears throat> so you've helped me again and not bother telling me and you've decided to pocket the money. I haven't pocketed the money. I don't pocket the money. It's gone in the kitty. So what am I going to tell my wife now? That you've <laughs> sold her car? That I've sold her car. Oh, she's going to be one of them. But she is. So don't you want to know how much you got for it? Well, the thing is, the two cars you've sold, yeah. obviously 50% of that is going my way. Yes. And then my wife will want at least 75% of that. Yeah. Yeah. To buy another smart. It's not going to happen, is it? But no, no, no. It's, it's not, not, <laughs> not going to happen, is it? No. I've got you a good price for it. You just wanted space. As if you haven't got enough space with all this junk out Steve, here. you... A smart is that big, so you think... Steve, you oh, said, you you said you wanted to get rid of it. I never said about getting rid of the Pajero, but you got rid of that as well. The Pajero, you said it's not worth repairing. Yes. So if it's not worth repairing, yeah? What do you think this is, a scrapyard? Yes. Without any doubt, it's a scrapyard. All you've got to do is get that camera and walk around here and look at all this junk that you've been putting screwdrivers in a fuel tank. You're saying... And put it in a jerry can. You're saying... That this looks like a scrapyard. Yes. How can you say that, Steve? Because that's exactly what it is. I mean, what's that? That's There's a thing behind it. You can't say that is a scrap. That's my Mercedes. It's scrap. That's my Mercedes. I'm having. I'm hoping to. I'm hoping to use it next week. Listen, plain and simple fact is, this has been used by part for parts over many years. Yeah. And there's nobody would ever get that going. This thing here, I can't even imagine why it's here. It's just an absolute piece of crushable junk. What's what? crushing? That, we're we're going to crush it. So it's a scrapyard. I was right. It's a scrapyard. No, it's not a scrapyard. It's a, it's a scrapyard. Yeah, yeah look, there's my favourite. Uh, do you remember that one? The Volkswagen. No. Yes. Oh, the Opal. Yeah. No, is it an Opal? 
snow for you. Oh yeah, the uh, the Astra. The Astra the turned upside down. Yeah, that fell off, off the. Fell off the fault lift. Yeah, yeah. Well, what else is there? This, what's this? What's this? Yeah. It's a red car. Volkswagen Polo. Yeah. You know they're very collectible. I can understand you for keeping this. This BMW looks like it's. That is Lucas's BMW because Lucas has got one. He's restored, hasn't he? Yeah. It's right on drive. Yeah. That's his spares. That's his spares. Well, it's, obviously, he got a very good car. He's never used any spares for because this has been here for about four years now. And. So it's just littering the place up. No, it's not. Yes, it is. You said it isn't a scrapyard. It is a scrapyard. It's not a scrapyard. This is a bit more like it, but somebody's given it a bit of action. Yeah. Clumsiness. It'll be here with the fault lift truck without anything. Oh, no. here's another one. Look, here's another one without a fuel cap. I wonder how that water got in the fuel. This, this is the 600 we've got to restore. There's the old 280. That's the only thing you've mentioned so far that is worth restoring. That's, That's true. That's the only thing yeah. that needs any thought and time spending on. Oh, look who's here. Carlos! What? What are you doing in there? He's saying that this looks like a scrapyard. Now, see, it doesn't. Yeah. Uh, a little bit of a scrap, but not much. It's all scrap. Yeah. It's all scrap. Maybe... I don't know. Maybe that isn't. And maybe that isn't. But the rest of it is scrap. Uh, everything is scrap. What are you looking at now? Well, just junk that's kicking about. It's an old Honda, yeah. Yeah, it's got Honda written on the side. Yeah, it does, yeah. Anybody yeah. looking at that? Yeah. Can you tell what it's off? Honda what? I know what it's off. Answer, answers pleading, please in the comments. If anybody wants a big pile of Honda something bits. Yeah, and, uh, yeah. and this. That's a V8 Rover. That's a V8 Rover engine. So that's another bit of scrap. It's something else that you will like. Yeah, look how about that. Uh, no, that's not it, sorry. No, no, right. Nor that. Nor that, nor that. Yeah. What about Renault 8? Two Renault 8s? Yeah. Is it a Renault 8? It's a Renault 4. Oh, Renault 4, Renault 4. Yeah, it's got a Renault 4. Two CV. Yeah. There's my Jimmy. You haven't never seen that, have you? Yeah, I've seen the Jimmy. Have you? Yeah. Okay. No, but you've never, never seen it working. We've all never seen it working. No, but we've bloody rolled it, didn't Yeah. And how about that? Do you know what that is? Yeah, that is a runaway. But it's a special one. So it's, I think it's the normal one, and it'd be made to look like a special one. It's a Gordini. Not really a Gordini. It's really a Gordini. A really a Gordini. A really a Gordini. It's got an engine in it. Yeah. Good, isn't it? I suppose it could be. Mm. That's fiberglass. That's not fiberglass. It is. It's tin. I can't see why you think this is a scrapyard. It's just a few things I've got, I got lying about, waiting to be done. About a week's work here. It's taking more than a week to catalogue the rubbish. <laughs> so do you like me, do you like me Gordini? Gordini's alright, it's a lot of work. Oh, it's a lot of work. I can't see the, all the bits being that cheap. No. Maybe they are. Yeah.